So obviously behind me we got Rufus the R2, that's Joel's uh, Colorado, and we're here for the release of the new Overland series. And with that said, we've got a little bit of work ahead of us. Joel will be here, Jose's gonna be underneath, we're gonna pop the system on, and let you see what our first impressions are from someone who's never heard it and never seen it, and someone who's really put their truck to the test. So we've got a lot of things coming up here. We're gonna hopefully get you through even to the factory to see how we made it. But now, first and foremost, let's get it on the truck and hear what it sounds like. Wiping the sweat of my face But I'm gonna shine like the sun I'm gonna climb on my own yeah, so first, like I said, we're gonna go and install the front pipe first. Then, as we go, you know, muffler uh, and tail pipe. So, pretty simple process. Today, my mind is I like how it has a little deep note to it, but not like overly deep or, or ricey or crazy. Uh, the, the tune frequency that we do inside the pipe gives us the ability to kind of control that mid-range that causes the buzz. No yeah. one likes that V6 buzz. Yeah. So that was a big part of when we tuned both the internal muffler and the resonance chamber. When it's working, it's it's really giving you a nice performance note without sounding too buzzy and kind of like That's that. why I like, so even, so like I mentioned before, I didn't hear anything before that I liked. And <clears throat> one of my buddies went on show and he had one of your other uh, series exhaust, it was MagnaFlow. And I was like, man, that sounds good. And that was probably the best sound, like to date, the best sounding exhaust that I've heard. And you know, I, I've been meaning to look at them, but I, I know there was two different setups. There's one that you have the dual. Mm -hmm. And then the single, but I mean, even still, it would have it would have hung down super low compared to. And the dual was absolutely not a question yeah. because it, it literally travels right where the spare tire is. You have to pull the spare tire out for that, yeah. and really, it, it goes right where uh, the stock exhaust hung too low. Yeah. So the, the Overland series really readdressed kind of how we organize things underneath, so that you can run a high clearance bumper and not see an exhaust pipe hang out from underneath. I know. I didn't realize how much of an eyesore it was until now it's gone. <laughs> I mean, I did at first. I was like, no, I'm going to cut it, but I just oh, got, got used to it. To it. Yeah, yeah, I got used to it, so I'm like, whatever. But now it's like, looks good. Sounding good, like the startup and stuff. Stepping on it because it sounds good. <laughs> Pissed off, you're just like exploring it. Yeah. Wait, I want to see what it sounds like with the thing closed. The window's closed. You sure you don't want to find the flow? <laughs> now I do. <laughs> Dude, it sounds good. Wow. What a difference. And what's on there right now? The it's the silent one. So I, if I put the other one on, it's going to be... No way. Yeah. No, no, so as far as an exhaust goes, I mean, for the longest time, I didn't like anything that was on the market. I mean, just because, you know, it's a V6. 
it, it doesn't sound the best. I mean, but here, I mean, Nightfall, they made something that sounds good. It functions, you know, it, when I got the high clearance rear, I noticed my exhaust hung down really low. This is a big gap. I was actually just gonna go under there and cut it because I mean, I wasn't even looking for an exhaust because I didn't really like anything. But I mean, this exhaust, I mean, it's, it's customizable. So you could, you want, you want it to be nice and loud. You, could, you have a nice and loud. You could be, you know, nice and mellow too, which I like because sometimes I just like to cruise listen to my music or whatever. Um, but, you know, I like to have fun too in the desert. And, I have that option too, which is cool. So I mean, like Rich was saying, it checks all the boxes for me. You know, functionality, you know, performance, and you know, it's it's pretty much it. You know. 